Hi, my name is Morgan Bowen. I'm a senior in soil and crop sciences in horticulture with a concentration in viticulture and enology. And today I will be talking to you about the potential for grapevine vigor control by partial root zone drying. Vigor is expressed as the rapid growth of the parts of the vine. Excessive vigor has become a problem in recent years due to advances in technology. It is important to help reduce excessive vigor in grapevines because if not, the grapes will produce less fruit, and also excessively vigorous vines will have reduced quality and increase in disease. A lot of money is also spent on trellising systems and water management for excessive vigor. And today, the methods of control that we have have undesirable side effects. As I mentioned before, there has been an advance in technology, especially in terms of viticulture in recent years. There is an excessive vigor in grapevines as a result of use of irrigation, use of fertilizer, cane and spur pruning, vigor-inducing rootstocks, and also selective breeding. Here you can see an example of excessively vigorous vines. Fruit clusters are shaded and therefore they increase the chance of moisture, limited airflow, and thus resulting in more chance of disease. This example is not sought after for many grape growers. Today we have a few methods to help control excess vigor in vines. You can see here a list of seven different techniques used to help with control. However, each method has an undesirable effect on either yield or fruit quality without actually accomplishing the goal of reducing vigor. The importance of partial drying of roots lies in the theory that the system will reduce vigor without negative side effects. In, the, in an experiment conducted by the Australian Journal of Grape and Wine Research, the root system was split into two parts and on each side was um, a container that was put under a different condition of study. The system was a well watered and the other side was a drought stressed system. In the picture to the right, the experimental design is shown and in the picture to the left, this is what an actual grapevine root looks like. In conclusion, using partial drying of roots, it was found that fruit yield and fruit quality was reduced. However, it's very hard to impose mild stress on a plant. There seems to be no happy medium, but by comparison, partial root drying is far less dangerous and easier to manage. This experiment was also carried out in containers, so field vines may have a larger potential for vigor to be reduced. If this process was followed out further, we could find that there could be a reduction in chemical costs, water costs, and expensive trellising systems. Reducing vigor is important, but it is also important to maintain a healthy balance between fruit and vegetative growth for your vine, so in turn you end up with the highest possible fruit quality. Thank you for listening.